drawings with uh, this gear driven cyclo drawing machine. Uh -huh. uh, so, first I put on uh, uh, some paper. Yeah. To work on. So, so every time you change a little bit, uh, it will give you a different pattern. Yeah, so on the drawing. Uh, I've, I've done a few. So this one, for example, is with 32 right here and 40 feet over here. And this one is pretty nice. I think so. It's 32 over here and 50 over here. Mm -hmm. And I just did 58, so now I'm going to 60. 60 teeth of upper over here. Mm -hmm. And I use the washers just to. Make, make, it bar. Smooth, make it smoother. Yeah, smooth, and I want to bar the bar to be, uh, to be a bit higher than uh, this one. Oh. oh, yeah, right. And then I choose a color, blue, for example. And I use the club pen just to have it tight, and then use the weight of the bar and the hot tape. So mm -hmm. like that. And I just see what happens if I turn it. Oh, yeah, look at that. It was a bit surprising what will happen. Mm -hmm. And sometimes it goes back to its like beginning point or starting point, mm -hmm. just right away. And sometimes it keeps on doing new stuff. Mm -hmm. So this seems to be like this seems to be like five sections of the drawing, I guess. After a while, you see like a pattern almost. Like a yeah. It's coming. So you can change uh, different color anytime. Yeah. Okay. So what I'm doing now, I'm, I'm trying to uh, see all the um, combinations. So I have like 12, yeah. 12 years. So yeah. around 144 different combinations. It's endless combinations. Yeah. So it's almost endless. Yeah. But so I guess it's doing the same pattern yeah. now. So. So this is a pretty regular one. And then I oh, so you mark it down with kind of gears? Yeah. Combination. So after, so after a while. All right. We'll have to move. There you go. Yeah. That's it. Beautiful. Hey. After the second one or the next one. Yeah. Let's see. and sixty. So. Um, yeah. I guess we. Nice. Get to 72 of them, mm -hmm. and all the teeth. Uh, I had a look on the website of somebody who did this as well. So, all the teeth are like the amount of feet, teeth mm -hmm. are set in such a way that you always end up with them, or most of the time, you end up with like nice patterns. Yeah, because when you just have like random amounts of teeth, mm -hmm. it will get very messy and it's very random. So, uh, so later on, you're gonna put it out in the table and have people. Uh, yeah, maybe. So tomorrow I'll, I'll present it with a brown bag session, uh -huh. um, and maybe later on I'll test it out on the floor a yeah. bit more. Uh -huh. But the last time I did that, that this bar broke down, so I had, oh. I had to fix it a bit. Make a little bit thicker. Yeah, a bit uh -huh. thicker. Yeah. So, but I want to be safe for tomorrow, like for presentation. I, so. I won't test it out before. Mm -hmm. All right. So it's funny, like in the beginning, it's so random, right? Yeah. What do you think it is? Uh, shipping up. I guess it's, it's making a new pattern, still making new lines. It's not repeating itself right now. Oh. Bar, I made it thicker. This one, uh, so there's some more resistance uh, in the whole system. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So sometimes the hand crank will just come up. So do take a bit. So I 
guess the pattern is now repeating itself. Awesome. Oh no, so it's still making new, new lines. It looks like this one got a lot of, a lot of circles. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. So it's so different from that one, for example. Right. Right. Yeah. Thank you so much. Okay, you're welcome.